Hello there, fight friends. MMA Andy Cotterell here with Rodrigo Cezanando, who will be fighting this weekend at BFL 79 against American Scotty Stockman for the BFL Super Lightweight Championship. Rodrigo, how are you, sir? Oh, I'm good, sir. Thank you. Uh, I'm so much excited for my next fight here in Vancouver. I will take my title. Like, great fight. Brutal. Uh, I'm great. I'm feeling great. So we were talking briefly before the the conversation now about you originally being from Brazil and you come to Canada now to train to fight. Is there a culture in Brazil where belts are very important or is a, a fight more important than the belt? So I think I yeah, put in my mind the next fight is always the so much important than last fight. Mm -hmm. So my next fight right now is so much important for me. And after this fight, I put in my mind again, is my next fight is so much important for my car here. Yeah, every fight's important at this stage, especially when these days, if you want to go to the UFC or you want to go to a big organization, they look at your record. And, you know, a loss, even though one loss isn't the end of the world, it is a bit of a setback, isn't it? Yeah, the, my one loss, uh, I had like one year and a half, maybe. I don't remember when. But uh, I the show to Brazil gave me my opportunity like three days before event, and I say yes. Like I know he's very very good, he's have a good record. But I say yes, I wanna go, and I fight three rounds with him. But unfortunately, he'll win. But changed so much my fight, my 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 mind for fight, my mind for training. So. I learned a lot with this loss, and I don't want to lose again and more. So I will do everything like I will try my best always for don't lose again. Yeah. Okay. Good. Well, uh, these these video interviews I do are watched by uh, MMA fans all across Canada, and you're pretty well known in Vancouver. But for the people in the rest of Canada who might not know you, take a minute and just introduce yourself. Say who you are and where you're from and, and what kind of fighter you are. So, sorry, say again? Just introduce yourself. Say who you are and, you know, what kind of fighter you are and where you live and where you train and all of those kind of things. Hi, guys. My name is Rodrigo Cezinando. Uh, I'm Brazilian. I have 26 years old. Uh, I started my training in MMA in Brazil with my coach, Tad Slate and Emerson Falcão. And one year ago, I changed them. My, my home, my, my house, my life, everything for, for Vancouver. And right now I train Lions MMA Vancouver with Coach Pauli, Amir, and Nero. So I'm so, so much happy for this opportunity, for living here in a nice culture. And I will, I will defense right now. My second room is Vancouver. Uh, because my, my opponent is from USA, and right now I'm from here. In my mind, I'm from here right now. He's my home. Yeah. When you, when you decided to come to Canada, you could have gone anywhere in the world. How did you pick Canada as a destination? So, yeah, I, I text the BFL, and I just say for him, bro, I need just one one opportunity if you give my opportunity you don't don't i don't will make you upset i i promise i will do the fight so much excited for you and he okay you can i i will give you opportunity you have one chance just one only one and he give the Saeed the big big opponent here so so many people don't want to fight with him and I say, yes, I want to fight with him. Let's go. I just want to fight. And this fight is for title shot. I win and try to fight for title after, but cancel, unfortunately, and try one more fight, but cancel again. And now I will fight next Thursday. I hope so. <laughs> and yeah. I'm so much happy for come back to work. I'm feeling great. My body great mind perfect good so i'm so much happy right now well i'm happy that you're happy when Thank i took you. a look at 
uh, when I searched to learn about you on the internet, I saw lots of grappling, lots of Brazilian jiu-jitsu videos. So I'm, is it safe to say that you are mostly a grappler, but how's your striking game? So my striking right now, I can say so much brutal than last fight. So I improved a lot the last year. Yeah, when I fight with Saeed, uh, I start to w work with Cold Pauli and the, the time like so much short, I improve a little bit, but right now I'm feeling like real striking, real grappling. I don't think I have so many ways for everybody and I ask every single day who wanna more than me and I don't listen to nothing. <laughs> Well, so you've got a really strong opinion of your of your skills, which is very important to have. So that's good to hear. What do you know about your opponent, Scotty Stockman? So I know he's the wrestling boxing. So I like him. I love striking. If he, I had to strike with him, I will do great. Uh, if I have to fight with him in jiu-jitsu or grappling, I can do. So I'm ready for uh, always like uh, grappling or striking. I will fight hard. I will fight great. I will so much excited for my fight. Okay. Well, that's good that you want to make it exciting because uh, people like yeah. watching exciting fights and the fans. Exactly. Once, I don't once the fans. Boring fight. I don't want to do oh. boring fight. Yeah. Well, that's, that's good to hear. I'm sure BFL appreciates that too. Yeah, exactly. Okay, Rodrigo, uh, thank you very much for speaking with us. I want to give you an opportunity now. If there's anybody you'd like to thank or anything you want to say to anybody, you can open up now and say that. Okay. I can say the first thing in English and Portuguese. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah. So I want to say yeah, yeah. thank you so much for Lions of MEA. Uh, got you with Mills, my ex sponsor here. Help me a lot with my foods. Like I'm feeling so much power after food. Uh, I'm so so much happy. My physiotherapy Harry helped me a lot, and I wanna say thank you. Na verdade, eu quero dizer obrigado para Bio Naturalis, Guaracrac, Projeto Acolher, uh, Edu Viana, Nova União Niterói. É, Emerson Falcão, Thales Leite, Lucas Caldas, Tony Carlos, toda essa galera aí que vem me ajudando muito lá no Brasil também. Então eu quero sentimento de gratidão que eu tenho por todos e só quero dizer muito obrigado por acreditar no meu trabalho e vamos com tudo. Ok, well, I think that's yeah. it. All right, well, yeah. Rodrigo, it was my pleasure to speak with you. Good luck on Thursday at BFL 79. Thank you so much, my man. Nice talk with you. I hope see you again with my title. <laughs>